the plenary today. It was quite exciting. We saw the EAU lecture uh, presented by Professor Marcus Drake. It was superb and excellent. Uh, talking about the new approaches in terms of uh, the treatment of male locks, which uh, established a new paradigm how to treat this condition overall around the world. Listening Dr. David Klumpet, and he, when he tried to explain his work about the UPEC stuff, it was great, you know, especially for my research. Uh, I was discussing uh, GI motility and how it relates to neurogenic bladders. I guess the relationship is tighter than I had figured, and I uh, just appreciated some of the research that they were doing. Well, the most important thing is that we should uh, individualize the treatment approach for each individual patient and uh, we should consider all the pathologies that are associated with this condition as the causes in order to be successful for that treatment. So overall this is a very strong important message and we were really really glad to have the EAU presence during this meeting. And I think it's, it's very interesting today as usual as tomorrow as yesterday uh, a lot of uh, very useful information a lot of some interesting procedures I have never heard. Urology is absolutely international idea uh, like uh, like medical idea at all, and uh, European, American, uh, or Russian, uh, in my case, uh, it doesn't really matter. We're all doing the same cases, same patients. Continuing education is critical, and if you stay uneducated, you practice medicine from when you graduate residency, and if you don't learn, you're going backwards. I think uh, gives the physicians, urologists around the world, the opportunity to be uh, state of the art and cutting edge. Um, scientific information that it's valuable and important uh, for the care of patients with urological conditions all around the world.